hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video i'll be showing you how to create an st map in nuke something like this so i have taken this footage and i have trimmed it to 35 frames for this tutorial purpose so first what i'll be doing is uh, creating a lens distortion node so uh, normally this a uh, distortion value will be given uh, from a matching artist either from uh, 3d equalizer software or pf track uh, so if not uh, you can also create it in nuke so as i do not have any lens uh, grid values or any checkerboard uh, which helps for me to calculate this distortion so what i will be doing is i'll be manually calculating uh, in nuke so i'll be going to image analysis and uh, i will give the range so as i'm using 35 frames i have given 35 and uh, so features and tracks and analyze sequence so this might uh, take some time so i'm gonna skip it so the distortion is calculated with this features given so as you could see we did get a barrel distortion and also there has been a little bit of blur as the distortion is applied so if you don't want this uh, kind of uh, the if you don't want this kind of effect so like if you just want this to be black so just give a transform node where uh, it has a default black outside so which uh, eliminates this effect uh, so if uh, adding a transform node doesn't work make sure that uh, you have selected this black outside so now we did get the distortion so but there is this thing that this distortion has been applied to the sequence as this is under this this is under the image distortion for example if you see the output type is image so there is also an another option which is called as a displacement is where it helps for estimate so for example if we go and check in this channel motion so there is nothing this channel contains nothing so whereas if I go to displacement and now I go to motion so there is a value here so this is the displacement value so make sure to check this displacement and we have to take the channel separately outside so how to do it so we have to add a shuffle node so by adding the shuffle node and uh, we should change it from RGBA to that particular motion channel so that we can get this channel so how to take this out so we just write this out so uh, when you write this Im image file out uh, kindly make sure it to be an exr file so it should not be a jpeg file because jpeg files are compressed files and exr are just uncompressed and uh, they do not uh, lose any data so i'm gonna paste it in uh, I'm going to place it in this location like uh, stmap.exr so make sure to type exr and just uh, render one frame and uh, I'll be using that particular frame here so now we do got the ST map and uh, we have this sequence file the sequence file is the source obviously and the ST map is the ST map so what do we need right now is the ST map node so where uh, source pipe is connected to source and uh, ST map is connected to ST map and in this ST map in order this in order to make this displacement effect to work so you have to go to the uv channel and change it to rgb so now if i connect this viewer to the st map 
so you should be able to see this distortion which we have created so if you if you want you can also cross check with this distortion so right now it is in displacement i'll be changing this to image and uh, if you check it so this is the exact uh, same distortion which we have created so this is how you create an ST map in Nuke. Hope you guys like this video. Thanks for watching.